Airport officials worry that a new subdivision could shut the airport down. It's one of the many reasons why school, fire officials, and Batavia Township residents are against an annexation to allow for the new housing development. Investigative reporter Paula Christian breaks down what's at stake here when county commissioners vote on this project Wednesday. What happens to these 175 acres in Batavia Township will have a huge impact on Claremont County's airport. And it all boils down to one word, annexation. This land in Batavia Township is undeveloped for now. The village of Batavia wants to annex it and allow its sale to a developer who plans to build 321 small homes. These new homeowners would get a property tax abatement, meaning they would not pay taxes for schools, roads, fire, or other services for 15 years. They still have to provide these services, but they're getting zero tax dollars for it. Karen Swartz wants to keep the land in Batavia Township. She's administrator for the township, which has 30,000 residents who live mostly on large lots with big yards. It doesn't fit into the neighborhood. She spoke out against the new subdivision and the annexation at a public hearing earlier this month. So did the CEO of Sporties at the airport, superintendent of Batavia Local Schools, chief of the local fire EMS district, and property owners like Michelle Snyder. What is the benefit? In my opinion, the benefit comes solely to the village. Snyder lives near the planned subdivision. She says the village, which would get income taxes and pilot payments from the new residents, would be the big winner. While neighbors like herself may be forced to pay more for new levies, driven by the strain of new residents on school and fire. Right now, it seems like the laws tip in the favor of the municipality at the expense of the townships and the township citizens. In a statement to the I-Team, Batavia Village Administrator Ken Geis says in part, I believe that annexations are good for property owners, the village and the county as a whole, and promote new development. Mike Minear is an attorney for the three landowners who are asking for the annexation. He says Ohio law supports these annexations and the rights of property owners. And annexations by municipalities of adjacent territory are, are to be encouraged. But Chuck Gallagher, he's against it. He's manager of the Claremont County Airport and says lighting from these new houses so close to the airport will create hazards for the pilots. The subdivision also has plans for five retention ponds, which he says will attract wildlife that are dangerous to planes. He worries the Federal Aviation Administration will complain and possibly close the airport. The airport could potentially be shut down if this development happens. The village of Batavia has already annexed two other parcels of land in recent years to build subdivisions where new taxpayers live outside of the township. Claremont County Commissioners are set to make their decision on Wednesday, but legally they can only deny an annexation like this if the detriments to immediate neighbors outweigh the benefits of the annexation. Paula Christian, WCPO 9, I-Team.